Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to our channel and thanks for logging on. Today we're discussing the Vacheron Constantin Patrimony, reference 81180 in 18 karat white gold. You can see and you can purchase this ultra thin dress reference on our website. Subscribe to this channel if you enjoy these videos and please click on the card in the upper right hand corner of the screen. Yep, that one in the upper right to see our full sales listing for this watch with accessories included in the sale, high resolution images for your desktop, and naturally complete pricing details for this white gold Geneva Hall mark ultra thin manual reference. And you can see on my wrist six and a third inches, 16 centimeters in circumference. The watch has a modern diameter of 40 millimeters. This isn't the traditional size for a dress watch. However, it is supremely traditional in its proportion of dial to bezel, bezel to lugs, and thickness, which is only seven millimeters. And you can see the generous domed slope of that sapphire and bezel. The watch wears relative to a tight cuff even thinner than its seven millimeter thickness. Now from lug to lug, it's quite manageable. 45.5 millimeters is the span across the wrist, meaning that this timepiece can be worn with perfect proportion and elegance. In my estimation, on a wrist down to as small as 14 centimeters in circumference. Now the watch has a beautifully slim black, monotone stitch, folded edge, unbolstered alligator leather strap. You can see the curved spring bars to trace the arc of the case for additional elegance of line. On the underside, supple calf skin against the wrist and a beautifully finished Maltese cross motif, polished white gold pin buckle. The watch wears exceptionally compact and yet it has a satisfying weight to it, mass on the wrist, thanks to its modern 40 millimeter diameter again, 33 to 35 would be a very traditional dress watch size. This is neither undersized nor oversized, but right sized. And when I talk about the mass of the watch, I do mean mass with a full solid case back made of 18 karat white gold. It has more heft than you would expect. Now you may ask, why is there a solid case back on a watch with a Geneva Hallmark caliber? And the simple reason is to get the watch this thin and yet make it durable and water resistant to 3 ATM, a solid case back is necessary, but in the ultimate perhaps signature of integrity that a brand can give to a client, the watch is artisanally finished internally to Geneva Hallmark standards and only your watchmaker will ever see it. So it's there because it's the right thing to do, it's the traditional way to do it, but again, structural considerations warrant a full white gold case back. Now, what you see externally is just as beautiful. Now, you can see the dial. It's silver, yes, and it's a matte finish, but there's something that's perhaps remarkable about this silver dial that is not universal to the type, and that is that this one has a slight cream tint to it. It's almost like a natural eggshell color with its soft granular surface and that slight off-white. Now, the off-white tone makes it more elegant and more distinct from the indices, the hands, and the bezel. White and white and white can quite simply whitewash a watch. You want to be able to say that there is some contrast, some tonal variation, and silver with white gold hands and indices and a white gold case sometimes overwhelms, sometimes seems sterile. Because there is a little bit of an off-white cream eggshell tinge to the style, the watch is so much more distinctive, so much more appealing for it. Now you'll note all of the indices polished and hand applied white gold, as is the Vacheron Constantin Maltese Cross atop the signature at 12 o'clock, and the baton style hands for the hours and minutes are of white gold. Now of course you ask what is the difference between the patrimony and the traditionnel lines? The easiest way to tell is always that the traditionnel has the Dauphine style hands and on the patrimony you have this more traditional vintage inspired baton style and the watch is definitely inspired by Vacheron watches of the mid 20th century considered to be the heyday of the ultra thin men's dress watch now what sits beneath that white gold case back is a Vacheron Constantin 20 jewel manual wind in-house caliber 1400 as I mentioned it is finished to Geneva Hallmark standards and the movement itself being incredibly slim makes this watch possible. With a 40 hour power reserve, you'll enjoy your daily interaction winding the timepiece and significant for any high end manual movement. The quality of the crown in the hand, the tactile feedback is superb. Creamy with just enough detents of the ratchet wheel as you wind it to full power. You can see and you can purchase this ultra thin Vacheron Constantin Patrimony on our website.